guys, Brap Sprap here, and, um, have you ever thought that you want to be a hacker? Well, or at least look like one to your friends. Um, today I'm going to give you a quick tutorial on uh, how to do just that. So, one of the first things you're going to want to do, um, is open up, it's included in your computer, I'm on Windows 10, but what you're going to want to open up is something called the command prompt. So, there are two ways to run it. You can either press Windows and R, and um, type in CMD, I've already got it typed in there. Hit enter, here it is. Or you can click on this bar here, just type in CMD, or, or type in command prompt. Here, click it, it'll come up. Okay, so um, what you want to do, drag it to the side so it looks, you're going to have another window here. Um, so from here, this is this is called your terminal or your command prompt in Windows. Um, what you can do here is change all your files, and, but you can also you can check them and modify files. But you can also um, check for things online and stuff like that. And it's quite a cool way of looking like you're hacking pe things outside of your computer and indeed inside your computer. So. One of the first things you're going to want to do is type in echo off. Um, what the echo off does is it turns off this C colon backslash users backslash backslash perhaps. <laughs> um, and it turns off that so it doesn't look as unprofessional. Type in color 2. Color 2 is green. You can have color 1 which is blue. I prefer color too because it looks a bit matrixy. Um, next thing you want to do is type in title. Um, now, see here, this is not, this doesn't look very good. You can keep it, won't look as professional. So what this, what this title does is basically changes the title for this. So I'm going to call it hacking. Um, what should we do? It? No, let's not have hacking. Let's have transferring bank funds. Something like that. Yeah. Dot dot dot. Let's have forty six percent complete. There you go. Enter. See this has changed now. Now this you can see what what you've been doing basically here. Um not very good. <laughs> Your friends are gonna be able to guess straight away what you've been doing. So type in CLS to get rid of all that. That stands for clear screen. Um now there are two ways to make it look like you're hacking in something. The first way is to type to find the ping of a website. Now, um, for you, those of you that don't know, ping is um, basically your connection to a server, and you can get your command prompt to test this. So I'm going to type in ping. Let's do PayPal so it looks um, like I'm actually transferring bank funds and what you're going to want to do is type minus T after this because if you don't after a while it just stops after it's tested this is just your test this is a yeah it's just testing basically a ping um, and this is the address but anyway what you're going to want to do is um, I'm going to CLS this again um, you're going to want to type ping www dot whatever your URL is um, and then and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna type minus T after it and what minus T does is ma basically makes uh, it display the ping indefinitely until you've actually um, closed the window and then it stops okay so the second way um, using the terminal or command prompt to do this is you're going to do the same steps as before um, color 2 you're going to title it, what should we call this minecraft, no let's not have minecraft, let's have um, counter strike hacks um, aimbot Brackets. Let's have installing. And 
then of dot 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 let's have something like 78% complete um, now we're going to type this infamous CLS clears everything um, and now what you're going to want to do is type tree unfortunately um, when I looked into this you can't type minus T because that wouldn't really make sense so um, the more this basically displays all of the files that you have on your computer I think it's actually looking at this not files but yes file folders not files but folders um, so the more folders you have on your computer and you get them just by installing things so the more used your account is normally people who've used their account more have got more folders um, install more things you're gonna get a longer tree um, on my other account on this computer um, I've got so many files on it that it just sort of starts scrolling for about three minutes or something if if you don't have that many files on your computer and you just want to do um, if you if you and you still want to use this method you can just type it a few times so it it, it looks better um, still it's relatively small but um, yeah uh, that's quite a cool way you can also have another window if you want or um, anyway Okay, so the second way that I found is um, a website called HackerType. HackerTyper, actually. Um, and what you do on here, basically, it types code for you. And you, what 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 you do to type the code is just basically press the random letters and numbers on your keyboard, um, and try to make quite a lot of noise with your keyboard as well, because then it makes um, it makes it sound more realistic and as you see there, it, it, this as well is going to be in green. So I'm going to show you what it looks like. And also I'm going to let you hear, I'm going to move my microphone closer to my keyboard so you can hear my key, my fingers hammering on my keys. Um, just so you know, I'm just pr pressing random keys. Um, I'm not programming any of this. This is completely the website. So, so as you can see here. Looks like you're like a professional hacker or something. Just yeah, get these. I'm gonna hack these noobs. And then, oh, I forgot to tell you this. Access granted. Um, here. Now what you can do is press Control. You if you want to go into Amazon Prime, Control P. Done. Um. It looks like you've been um, a granted access. It's quite cool. Um, I don't think these are actual hacks or anything. Um, I don't know what it does. Probably I haven't actually looked into it very much. But um, I think it is just a bit of garbage. Um, anyway. Thanks very much for watching this video. And um, I guess I'll see you guys later.